Okay, go. Alan Bundy here, um, giving an update. We've had uh, tremendous blessings from the Lord today. And uh, I want to acknowledge His hand in all these things. And uh, I also I want to make sure that it's clear that it is not me that are making all these amazing things happening happen. It is the Lord. And uh, that He is watching over us, protecting us, and that He is uh, bringing the right people to us to, to uh, do His work. That He wants us to be free. He wants us to choose Him. And, uh, and that is all we are doing here, is following His, His, His guidance and His direction. Um, we have uh, gone through some new developments here, and I'll try to explain them the best I can. Um, we drafted a, a couple letters. We had an individual who assisted us in doing that, a very wise individual who came and has been working with us for the last several days. Uh, we've uncovered uh, quite a few different uh, pieces of evidence. And we've uncovered uh, some corruption that is happening here between the county and the federal government. And uh, we have prepared a letter explaining some of that. And we served that to the, the county today, um, particularly to Judge uh, Stephen Grasty. Um, and uh, began the legal uh, proceedings to, uh, to try to correct some of these things. We also uh, serve them again today with our follow-up of what we're asking them to do and what we're wanting them uh, to do and, uh, as far as uh, procedures that we are uh, calling them to use the uh, jury roll call from the county to assemble an equestrian, jur equest uh, equestrian jury excuse me, and um, uh, so that the truth can be found and so that these evidences, these uh, these pieces that we have found, can be uh, brought forth by the people of Harney County. Uh, we we understand and know that truth is important, and that it must be brought forth. And there has been great efforts uh, for the truth to be suppressed. And we will not yield. We will not deter our efforts until the truth has been brought forth. And until the Hammonds can be exonerated, released from from, uh, from prison, and until these land matters that have affected the people of Harney County can be resolved, and uh, we know that the truth is important and it must come out, and that's what we stand on. Uh, we also have uh, understanding that we had, or I would like you to understand that we have I wanted to communicate with the uh, community that the Committee of Safety has put together a meeting and invited us invited us to speak on Friday at 7 o'clock at the county fairground, fairgrounds but that Judge Grasty called the Committee of Safety members and said that he will not allow any meeting to take place where we speak at and he will not at any county building he said and he made that very clear and acted as if he had arbitrary authority to to uh, determine whether someone was going to use a county building or not. Judge Grasty is acting uh, very irrational in these matters. He has brought in the FBI along with Sheriff Ward. They have been occupying downtown Burns for now uh, two weeks and putting that community in fear. But I want make sure make sure you understand that that fear is coming from them not from us we have showed no uh, aggression towards the community whatsoever at all and we are here 30 miles out of town in a peaceful effort to expose the truth and uh, that is why we're here we're asking people to come we still need you to be here to rotate in and out while we work on exposing these things and uh, thank you for listening to me. I know my words haven't been as clear as they might, be, might have been in the past, but I feel that great things are happening and I appreciate your time.